Sexorcism by Matthew Vaughn is a short, extreme horror story following a character known only as the Sexorcist, as she attempts to purge a demon from the body of a possessed man by means of, well, bumping uglies. The concept is pretty much exactly what you'd think of hearing the word Sexorcist. Our heroine has had her body and lady bits blessed by the church that she may remove evil spirits through her, uh, hoo. -hoo. This one definitely falls under the umbrella of extreme horror. And that's not really my bag all the time. I think the concept here is fun, but Vaughn attacks it from a darker angle, delving into the physical aspect of what this might actually be like and pulling no punches whatsoever. The descriptions here are vile. There's vomit, maggots, physical abuse, everything you'd expect from an exploitation style story like this. That said, a lot of it lost its effectiveness for me since it all came on so quickly and um, wasn't really given a whole great sense of stakes for me. The Sexorcist, who never gets a name, is a silent protagonist. And although we mostly ride along with her in the narrative, we aren't given much of her inner thoughts or feelings. It's touched upon here and there, which is nice, but mostly it's just about what's happening to her, which is described in enough detail to make you squirm for a while. I think I would have liked a little more variety in the writing here, especially for a story this short. Many of the sentences follow the same two-part structure. She does X as X happens. He grabs her as she does X. I felt the language and the structure could have been expanded upon to make this hit harder and feel less like a list of events happening. I think that might have actually helped it strike deeper with readers as well, which I imagine is the intent with a piece like this, to really hit hard, connect with someone, and tear them down. Fans of exploitation horror looking for some good gross-outs will appreciate this one. It's very short. Uh, only a few thousand words, I'd say. It's available on godless.com for pretty cheap. I went in blind based on a recommendation I saw from an author I follow, so I didn't know what to expect with this one. Check out Matthew Vaughn at authormatthewvaughn.com to find more of his stuff and to follow him. Again, this one's available on godless.com if it sounds like something you might be into. What do you think, Winston? Did uh, sexorcism do it for you? I rate sex sources of my Matthew on one silver cross and one bottle of lube.